Hi everyone, it's Kyle here again. Baseball season is out and about, college baseball season, and I'm finally back doing these videos. This is my first college baseball video of the year, and I'm very excited because I never got to do a University of San Diego video last year, so that's where I am today. Today, the Toreros take on the Portland Pilots, and I'm happy to be back at this university and not at Jenny Crick Pavilion for once. But I hope you guys are excited, and I hope you guys are ready for this one. I'm really excited, and I'm hoping for a very fun night tonight. So let's make our way inside the field, and I'll see you guys there. Let's do it. Diego. This is a really, really nice uh, venue. It's a lot bigger than I expected. It looks a little small when I look at the highlights because I like to see what it looks like from the TV. But being here, it's actually a little, a lot bigger. It's a lot nicer. I like the view as well, especially the home runs because of all the buildings. And USD being a more religious school, they have a little more religious style buildings. But nonetheless, this is a really, really cool place. And I'm very excited here. Let's, let's, let's do that. <laughs> Here is your starting lineup for your University of San Diego Toreros. Leading off, the second base number three, James Arcola. Batting second, the shortstop number 14, Justin DiCrecio. Batting third, the right field number two, Angelo Peraza. Heading forward, the left field number 28, Kevin Sim. Heading fifth, the starting pitcher number 24, Austin Smith. Heading sixth, the first base number 19, Jack Furovich. Heading seventh, the third base number seven, Will Worthington. Batting eight, the center field number 12, Justin Allen. And rounding out your tonight's your throws and batting nine, but catch number 16, Ariel Armas. The throws are coached by volunteer assistant coach Ryan Welch and assistant Sarah Cole and Matt Floor. The head coach for the throws in his second season is Brock Hundridge.
So one thing that's pretty common for these sports games is like other like high schools, middle schools, like club teams that come out and watch a game. What's interesting right now is that my high school's baseball team is actually here tonight. So that's cool. After four innings, we got a high scoring one. It's eight to six, Portland with the lead. Both teams Students went crazy in the first inning, but they slowed it down a little bit. But I still think we're gonna hit, I think we're gonna hit double digits for both teams by the end of this game. So, should be an exciting one. Let's keep this going. We played eight innings. It has been significantly slowed down. It's eight to seven as we head into the ninth. It's gonna be very competitive in this last one. It should be a fun one. Tight. We appreciate your attendance at tonight's game. The Portland Pilots win an absolutely close game here tonight. They defeat the San Diego Toreros 8-7 to seven after those first four innings, which were absolutely offensive showcases, especially four home runs. It was slowed down after the fourth, and only one run was scored by the Toreros, which made it 8-7, to seven, ultimately becoming the final. Plenty of chances for both teams to score, but the defenses stepped up and Portland ultimately was able to stop them in that ninth inning and they just played a very good game and both teams both teams played a very good game and it was really exciting here. I had a great time at this place. This is an awesome venue. I love it. It is big. A lot of energy from the crowd, a lot of people here. There was just a good uh, just a good good time here tonight and I, I really like it. Hopefully I get to come back here and watch another game because this is 
a really cool venue. But that will do it for my time at Fowler Park on the campus of the University of San Diego. Thanks guys as always for watching. And as always, I'm really happy that college baseball is back. So for now, see y'all at the next game. Bye.